chance of anyone remaining alive after that. Order your men back to the tower. To the tower. we can do for him now. Cargan! The entire city is in ruins. Khan's men all the way back to the tower. With Professor Norton again in Khan's power, we may never get back to the upper world alive. Don't forget, we still have the submarine. We better get down there right away in case we have to make a quick getaway. But what are we going to do about Benny's father? We'll take care of him right away as soon as the submarine is set to go. Your Imperial Majesty. The sacred city is wiped out. What of Sherrod and the strangers from the upper world? They all lie buried beneath the wreckage. Bring Professor Norton here to me. Nothing can stop me now from taking this tower and its equipment to the upper world. You don't think Professor Norton will fail you at the last minute? Not a chance. His mind is still transformed. He'll do anything I command him to. What is it? His Imperial Majesty Unger Khan wants to see you in the throne room. I'll go at once. Look at them, running around like so many ants. Their numbers must be unlimited. There seems to be no end of them. So much the better, for I intend to make them all my slaves or destroy them. You sent for me, Master. Are all the rocket motors attached to the base of the tower? Yes, Master. How long will it take us to reach the upper world? If we can strike the Gulf Stream, 
we should be within reaching distance of the coast within two hours. You mean you have no accurate calculations as to where we will emerge? Only my charts and compass can give me that information, Master. Charts, compass? I have them in my submarine, hidden in the inland sea. Captain Hacker, take some boat guides and escort Professor Norton to the inland sea at once. I have no time to wait. I'll only be a moment. this way. No doubt they're going to try and get back to the upper world in this submarine. We'll submerge the ship and take the control box back to the tower. <laughs> They'll never get out of Atlantis alive. <laughs> I have a better plan. They'll never expect to find any Volkites in the submarine. <laughs> while I raise the submarine. Take a look in the submarine. I'll slip in through the safety port and take a peek around, just in case. You stall around here and make a noise as if you're coming aboard.
And so did I for a minute, Billy. Come on down. They're just machinery, aren't they? Diana, stay with the submarine. Moloch and I are going back to the tower and rescue your father. If the tower rises here, you'll be in a commanding position to start your conquest of the upper world. Are your rocket motors ready? Yes, Master. They're primed for the final test. Start the test. Wait! Don't kill those men! That flame will melt the toughest steel. Clear the base of the tower for a test of the rocket motors. Stand clear of these rocket motors. They'll burn you to a cinder. Start the motor, but be ready to cut it off before it goes full blast. Satisfied, my plans are complete. Assemble all the men under bolt kite. We leave for the upper world immediately. Your Majesty, except the pair we sent to the Inland Sea. Send those two Volkites in with the others. He's out of control! What? It's crash calling him. Signal the other Volkites to attack them. Khan, we're going to bring Professor Norton back to his normal senses. My supreme art Khan will do as you direct. I wouldn't trust them too far. I'm not trusting them at all. Not so fast, Ditmar. Get in there. You'll have nothing to fear as long as Dittmar does what he is told. Come here and work these controls. You better not make any mistakes. Keep an eye on Dittmar. I can hardly blame you for not recognizing me in this outfit. Lieutenant Corrigan. That's right. What are you doing here? Where's my son and Diana? They're safe in the submarine. Bring Dittmar over here. Smash that thing. 
Quick, let's get down to the base of the tower and destroy those rocket motors. motors before crash gets down there and destroys them. Your Imperial Majesty, they've broken the control disc. Get to the master control and start the rocket motors by hand. But the strangers from the upper world, Your Imperial Majesty, aren't you going to make any effort to stop them? They won't get far once the rocket motors are started. The planes from the exhaust will take care of them. The motors are located around that bend. 